Hello everyone. Hope you all are fine. Today on a behalf of CCTV desk, we come up with new video. This video is all about a very important app, a very important one in the CCTV industry. Today we are going to discuss about V380 Pro for PC. So in this video, we are going to discuss with you what is V380 Pro for PC, what are its feature and function, and after that we'll tell you that how you get the file and how you install the file to make the camera live and able to access all its feature. So keep watching till end. Please like, share our video and subscribe to our channel if you are a new one. So V380 for PC, V380 Pro for PC is a app which is used to connect as well as control the CCTV camera on PC. It is also used to monitor the cameras on remote locations over the internet. So what are the main purpose of this software? The main purpose of this software is to access the camera live view on your screen or you can say you can remotely access any camera, locally access any camera. You are not only access lively any camera, but you can see the multiple channel at a time. You watch the recording of the cameras. Very important one. You take the snapshot of the video. You control the PTZ camera like you have a pan, tilt and zoom option. You can do it remotely. You save the live view of the camera. You can adjust the image parameter like color, brightness, saturation, whatever you want. Take a backup of the recorded videos and you can check the record remotely. Means the recording is on your device. To control the quality of the video recording and so many more. Now, we'll tell you also that what are the minimum, minimum system requirements. So for that, you should have at least Windows 8, 10, 11, 11 and you should have Core i5 processor, equivalent AMD processor and you should have at least 4 GB of RAM and 50 GB of free space on your hard drive. Why this is too much? Just because when you are want to access the live view and you, you may want to record the videos for that you need a storage. So for that you should need at least 50 GB of free space. Okay, software requirement don't take that, that much of uh, hard disk space but for the, this other purpose you need. Now we'll tell you that how you get the file and how you install them. For that you should open any browser and search for V380 for PC. And here my web, web favorite one website. And here I have found the top of the list like V30 Pro. Just open it. And here you find the a PC download button link. Okay. Let's click on this and it will redirect to your page where we have to wait a few seconds. And after that, it is start making your file. Once it is completed, 10 seconds, you find the downloaded zip file in this format. Just click on this. Let's close this at and your file is start downloading. Now let the down, down, download process to be finished and just after that click on show in folder and it will redirect your download folder. Here is your file. Just right click on the downloaded file and click extracts to v380 2.0.5. When you do this, you get the folder name same as the file name. Now it is extracted, just open the folder and here you the is your application file or installer file or exe file. Just right click on the application file and click as run as administrator. And click OK. Now click next. Just click the create a desktop shortcut and click next. And now click installed. Now just click launch v380 and click finish. When you do this, it, it will automatically open the software. Now here you should enter your, this is the login screen of the software. Here you enter username and password. You can register by your own, by clicking register here like this. So I just close this and return to login. I have already registered, so I, my, I use my email ID and password. So here is my email id 
एंड पासवर्ड now click auto login if you click this you don't want to log in again and again okay just click login now this is the interface of the software okay after login this screen you can see here is single camera view and here is four camera view nine camera view 16 camera view here is audio you can all the things you can manage from here okay now first thing you should do you should click add your device here are two option like add device and add device both are the same you click anywhere like i click here and here you can lens search option for example if your camera and your device both are on the same network then you should click on the lens search additions otherwise you should click on manually add by device id let's click on manually add device id and here you should enter the device id like okay now use password please don't be confused it is the username and password of the device device means device you are adding okay the camera you are adding here you just enter password and click add manually just close this and your camera comes online like this okay thanks for watching thank you thank you once again thank you have a nice day